All hail Biafra. This is Biafra Liberation Army Network coming to you again. Please do subscribe, like, share, and comment. Is there any one of you that is still giving any Naya Baribe or any of these criminal politicians in uh, that, that, that say they are representing Southeast? Any of you giving them, okay, Ugochuku, thank you for joining us from the USA. Any of you still giving them benefit of doubt? Please cancel it. They don't represent you, they don't mean well. And this man here actually said it the way it is. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, darling. Grazie, amore. Thank you. This man here said it actually the way it is. Listen to him, and then I will, you know, bring you the, you know, personal encounter of one of our brother here, one of our brother here, who had the encounter, who spoke with Mazin Namikano during the days of Abaribe being a shorty. And our leader actually gave his word. He gave his word. And most of you, you are going to confirm it today. And yes, our leader actually came online and said things like that. Actually, I remember that. Only that we cannot uh, be able to trace those videos or those uh, messages from our leader. But I remember our leader said things about uh, Henny Naya. And uh, even though he did not, may not mention his name directly, but he said a lot of things. All right, listen to this one, and then we will go back to the main topic while we're here. He's supporting the federal government. They cannot keep Kano for more than 24 hours. Say that again? Without this politician from the East mm. supporting the federal government, the, fe uh, the federal government will not keep Kano more than 24 hours if they are not getting the support from the Eastern people. Just like what they have said. Now the Kano presented a request. Seven requests, seven, I just said I have mentioned. And when Buhari came to commission project in the Southeast, Imo, precisely, go and look at the, the requests uh, Opus or Dima presented before Buhari. Mm. Release of Nam the Kani was not among the requests. If they are serious minded people, if they are, now they are not coming to do meetings to deceive Nigerians. When Buhari they are now coming to do meetings to deceive Nigerians. Thank God he said it is to deceive Nigerians. Actually, those meetings they were doing, those press conferences they are doing, it is to deceive Nigerians. Biafrans are not deceived. If there is any Biafran that is deceived with those meetings, then you need to check yourself. I'm sure you have malaria. Let me uh, make him repeat it again. The candidate was not among the request. If they are serious, my dear people, if they are, now they are not coming to do meetings. To deceive Nigerians. When Buhari came, why did you present when they came to commission, when they came to inaugurate uh, Opus or Dima, what was the request? Did he present a request before the president? He did not. So they are not going to do meetings. Why are they deceiving? Honest truth. Kanu for me, or to in other I don't see the camp the you have committed, or to in other by the law, by the court. Thank you. Did you hear that? I'll repeat it again. He's supporting the federal government. They cannot keep Kano for more than 24 hours. Say that again? Without this politician from the East mm. supporting the federal government, the, fe uh, the federal government will not keep Kano more than 24 hours if they are not getting the support from the Eastern people. Just like what they have said. Now the Kano presented a request. Seven requests. Seven. I just said I have mentioned. And when Buhari came to commission project in the Southeast, Imo, precisely, go and look at the, the requests uh, Opus or Dima presented before Buhari. Mm. Release of Nam the Kani was not among the requests. If they are serious minded people, if they are, now they are not coming to do meetings to deceive Nigerians. To deceive Nigerians, take note of that. I am specifically laying emphasis on it. To deceive Nigerians, Biafrans are not deceived. We can never be deceived. If they are serious minded people, if they are, now they are not coming to do meetings to deceive Nigerians. When Buhari came, why did you present when they came to commission, when they came to inaugurate uh, Opus or Dima, what was the request? Did he present a request before the president? He did not. So they are not going to do meetings. Why are they deceiving? Honest truth. Kanu for me, or to in other wise, I don't see the camp the camp you have committed, or to in other wise by the law, by the court. Thank you. 
Thank you too. Thank you too. Thank you. All right. Um, you have heard it. These criminal politicians that are showing up from every corner, calling Amazon American, Amazon can, you know, they can never deceive us. They can never deceive us. Any Nayabari be particularly, particularly. Now, I will go to, uh, should I go and play that narrative? His painting is making people believe that um, Martin Namdekano agreed in his nonsensical nonsense of uh, uh, that he will agree to a settlement. What have, what have you? Let me see. Do I still have that video? Do I still have that video? I don't know if I still have it. Yeah. I don't know if I see. Okay, I still have it here. Okay, now, so Tabari Bay is stopping the charts of those who are fronting Mazin Amikano now at the dying minute. Why? Because he wants to support the zoo. He wants to keep Mazin Amikano there. He wants to make sure everything about Biafra dies. In fact, that is the reason why he was a shorty to Mazen Namikan. And Mazen Namikan admitted it eventually after the so-called shorty. I'm telling you, you will hear it from uh, the eyewitness account this morning. Now, let me first of all play this, which was already aware. I just want to play to establish some of my points. All right. Uh, well, you know that uh, Senator Barbie has expressed strong belief that the Attorney General of the Federation would persuade the federal government to release uh, the separatist leader. And Barbie revealed that Kano, whom he had visited at uh, the Department of State Services, is willing to comply with any conditions set by the authorities for his release. Now, uh, based on a, put, uh, a particular newspaper called Newsban newspaper, they they actually of this of the note that one of the conditions that will be presented to Kano for his release will be for him to go on the ground and never speak on his franchise radio, which is about the agitation for uh, the uh, Biafra movement, and that he would openly denounce and disband the Eastern Security Network. So, also, he is to completely dissociate himself from Simon Epa, and of course, who, who has been enabling, you know, the pursuit of his release, and that the federal government is to launch a decisive operation against Simon Epa. That's basically what uh, an, uh, A. Naya Barbary is disclosing because he just met with Namdi Kanu within the DSS custody and that they're speaking with the Attorney General of the Federation on his release. What's your take on this? I do not think there is need to comment on um, submissions. Okay. The government has not presented the conditions to Namdi Kanu. And um, it will not be fair to uh, begin to insinuate what the government should present and what the government should not present. No, 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 it's not an insinuation. It's what Sakaribe is saying. He said, yes, Namdi Kanu will be released, but I can't tell the actual time. His release will come with a lot of stringent conditions. He will not speak on Radio Biafra again. ESN will be disbanded. Kanu will also dissociate himself from Simon Epa. These are some of the conditions that will be presented to him. This was a source that revealed to this news band newspaper based on the visit of uh, Abaribe to the DSS custody meeting with Namdi Kanu. I remember last two Week. I remember I, I had a conversation with you where I said that it is possible that this will be one of the conditions that they will put on ground in the negotiation for his. Okay, thank you, thank you, and uh, we are all aware that all these things that Abaribe, this, this narrative that Abaribe is selling now, have always been the condition for Mazin Namikano's release. It has always been the condition. Disband ESN, destroy ESN, stop coming to talk about Biafra and whatever in any of your radio. And then now that you will know that Mark Simon Epa is a force to reckon with, stop Simon Epa. That is all the conditions that Mark Simon have always had. That is why he has remained there. And these Southeast politicians, according to the first video I played, their hand and leg are on these conditions. And for them, it benefits them to have those conditions in place. Because without those conditions in place, eh, if those conditions are not in place, their position as Southeast politicians is dead and buried. Because Biafra comes and they are no longer relevant. So for them to remain relevant, Mazin Amkan must remain there. And those conditions must be actively, you know, active. 
It must be active. How will they not support the conditions? They, in fact, they are the ones that are bringing the conditions. It is no longer the uh, Nigerian government. Nigerian government has been caught naked, blatantly naked. They kidnapped Mazin Nambikano. International crime they committed on Mazin Nambikano. So they've been caught naked. So now, if the international communities are asking Nigeria, why have you not released Mazin Nambikano? Do you know what they tell them? Now let me shock you. Do you know what they tell them? They tell them that we want to release him, but his own people say they don't want him because he is a security threat to their own co community. That's why you hear them saying insecurity in the South is insecurity. That they even create that insecurity purposely so that when the international community now ask these criminal politicians or ask them, they will say it is because of this insecurity. That is why Mas Namkan is not released. There is so much insecurity. And they will not even tell you that uh, he's Mas Namkan, if we release him, it will end. No, they will tell you that they are holding him because of insecurity. And they are creating that insecurity on purpose. So that Mazin Namikano, whether he likes it or not, must Emmanuel has already defeated Nigeria. Mazin Namikano has defeated Nigeria. So if these people really want Mazin Namikano to be free, they will not be calling press conference. They will only go straight to the Nigerian government and tell them, what are you people doing? Are we in the same country? One Nigeria? This our son have won you in their own in your own court. Did you not did you not tell us that these courts and the judgment of the court will be the yastic? For his release, now he has won. He won you. He has been discharged and acquitted. Every cases of terrorism have been squashed. So why are you still holding him? That is where they will hold their hand. It is not on a press conference. And the most ridiculous one is that one of their the politicians went to Casina or wherever he went to to go and meet with Buhari. Buhari, an impostor. And of which you know that Buhari is late. Buhari is no longer there. He's gone. Buhari and Wala. Buhari and Wala. No, 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 Buhari and Wala. So who is the person you went there to meet? Who? To go and beg from Mazin Namikan. You did not go and meet the impostor while he, while he was in office. You are going to meet him when he has no more, he, when he is no longer in power. Eh? The impostor is no longer in power. So that's how ridiculous these people are. Have you even heard that he went to beat uh, Tinubu? You said he's somebody in power. But you are going to meet an impostor who is no longer in power. <laughs> eh? Do you understand? So yes, of course, we're going to, a definite uh, action is going to be taken. I have a full house this morning, and it's interesting that I have a full house, and I love it that I have a full house this morning. And uh, it's going to help me, relieve me of so much talk because I am very, very strong. But I am going to bring you a live encounter, an eyewitness account from one of our brother, my own beloved brother, Mazi Fukumen. I'm going to bring his uh, audio that he sent to me. He, he couldn't join me this morning. I wish he could join me. It would be more interesting. Mazi Okechuku Kelo. Chuku Kelo. I took permission from him. Uh, this is name is very long. That's why I have to <laughs> have to read it. Okay, chuku kelo. Okay, chuku kelo. Chuku kelo. That's his name. The brother you're going to be hearing his voice now. His personal message to me on his encounter with Mazin Namdekan. We have a full house this morning. Wow. His personal message to Mazin Namdekan and the, the humility of Mazin Namdekan is Jesus Christ. Mazin Namikan will respond to anybody. He will answer anybody. This brother got sent Mazin Namikan a message. After Mazin Namikan was heard giving, you know, appreciation to Enyinaya Baribe, this brother sent Mazin Namikan a message. And Mazin Namikan responded. Now I need to bring it so that you will hear it. Okay. Mazin Okay, wait. I want you to go, I want some things to go out. But that's by the way. Okay, that's by the way. Good. And uh, let's get this uh, here. Because I wanted some personal things he told me. I don't want them to play out here. Let's come to share it.
please, those of my friends on the on the room, I am going to play it. If you can hear it, please let me know. It's low, but it's going to speak up now. I remember not I do tell those who I felt like I, I should let them know. Can you guys hear it? Uh, Triple M, can you hear it? Yeah, 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 I can hear it. Okay, all right, thank you. Loud and clear, loud and clear. Thank you. You are one guy. Wait. I remember not I do tell those who I felt like I, I should let them know. I come up with my can in India, but if I come over and call our I was so specific in every in You are worried that you are worried that soon as you are worried that you that I come up with you have said it even online. I've said it on your live program that I sent a message to our leader. I've communicated with him one-on-one -on -one based on the, you know, giving any near that hype. Then, I've got my leader that demand is your poison. I praise from madam. So our leader, please do not hype this man in you. Our leader says you. Our leader, I agree. And the, I changed the time duration of our leader Parankata. Because this thing happened that I prayed, kind of prayer, I said some prayers through our leader life. That, that uh, phone out uh, here, call signal. That app. So send the message. Our leader call us. But reply, I am. I'm going to numbers with that machine. I just see him. I got a go. I am going to call him. I'm going to message him. Send the call. Phone out. Call him. Phone out. Call Reply. Yeah. Reply. Yes. Yes. I come back to the phone. Boy, our leader put the call. I was shedding tears. You know, talking to our leader. See a big call. I want to plead you for one thing or something. Can you hear? I'm just keep on a bali 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 very okay. That's not very horrible. My baby, and I worry that I worry that I'm putting her. I worry. I worry that when I'm no, I'm me. But that is so emotional. I worry that I say I should be strong. I'm putting her some different ways. I say, and then we should question him. Any day I free any man or life, ordinary, ordinary. People can go and search for the audio. Broadcast of uh, uh, on Friday question and answer of our leader interaction interact interactive section of our leader. Our leader said it because our leader said he will never praise these guys again because I was so specific about me and any nearby. Our leader will say on Friday after our leader put them or on Friday in the interactive session. Our leader said, "I say I will never please remind me, dear friends, any day you hear me praising this man." Serving the zoo, whatever position they occupy, serving the zoo from Biafra land. Anything you see me praising them, please caution me. I will no longer do that. I will no longer do that. You know? So go, our leader put your Our leader went further and said, that my serious most of them that claim that they stand solidity for him, that even the constitution, our leader said, even the constitution of the zoo never give them any right. To stand so because he have just kukambus and I could go on your stand this sort of thing. I will be in your work, mana yaho abari the big good deal or the illegal mono because copo name will be hana coca Nigeria gay. They say because these people will I want to say they will enact laws, they will not obey the law because of whom they are very evil. He's so evil. Let me tell you this in Germany or the two divine the divinity aspect of it in the evil. Because it's so so doing of the Lord that Abadi could not hold it any longer. Him, he gather all the criminals. They are not representing us from the eastern region, serving the zoo, but if I knew that, and those that never knew that they exist, they went on the, they come on the uh, floor of Senate to talk rubbish and then their topic is no longer massive than the can. That is... Now, it's Simon Eber. 
because they could not hold it in a long time. They find out that all oh, the Amagomago, the plans to kidnap Onyengu to see if, if, if he will even be killed and brought the cops and then I said, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, well, 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 let's continue. They wasn't able to, they never succeed in doing that. I don't go to Simon. All of them, if this guy is for let me tell you. Pierre mm. France will put out a law that these guys will be fit on. I don't can exile with Kurukudai. I got a book with the Yarando. Then a new at home in the Hamotadia will be sent to exile. Our law has to play this. I gave me, I gave me to, to bring sanity in black race at the at large. Everyone here for black race. The black race will now know that you don't just come out to do nonsense and then get away with it. They will no longer answer the same son name with Their name will be seen as a taboo. These guys, this to tell you that God is fully involved in your name. I was saying, more about had their yesterday. I was a half of the Maxwell, that and Maxwell, and I call of what our prime minister told him that our leader has to come out from there and then before you be able to listen to him. But everyone in the thousand there from the in there that him outside sees it as our leader saying it on that direct. So now, after that. Way we will find it to do. They said they are the idiot. I don't know if you know him. He called, his name is called Paul Lachal Salasen. If I send you most of my fight with that guy, yesterday, I didn't remind me because now Facebook is a step for a Jimon Wabra. More than people are not a Jimon Wabra before. When you see so in general messenger, we say, Did you need that money? And I have a conversation with the other people. Chatting money and about the chatting Julia Daddy Bezzer. Because one of the idiots of Tarani, Coral, is Julia. Even when I give up, put in those as in put everything money and about to wire. Even now we are being two. Because he works with me to be a new channel for. He told me that me and Simon and uh, those of us in North of Ireland, we are uh, our agitation is. With violence that we uh, we never know what the law means. That Mazen Nani cannot believe in the law, uh, believe uh, in the court that God will give him justice. and with justice, are you mad in Nigeria? You see, I'm ashamed of you. You run to UK, you pitch there, claiming to be a, a, an attorney at law in UK. What stops you to go down to Nigeria and become that lawyer you claim to be? This is how you. Pay. If I even want this guy in age, I didn't come. I'm not going now. But we are going to say, listen, whatever you and I said here, I keep record. You don't know me very well. I screenshot. Don't worry, at some point, when you have a screenshot, I said earlier that moment. He said, this is our conversation. I wonder what has most we will revisit this nonsense. Now, we can send you that video. Let's take one reply. You are reply. Him. Send you the video, uh, Maxwell. Attach all the whole conversation. Money and I have a to read. Send it here. Or return the here. See, this was the same law called Mazen Nanikani. You said he believed that Simon Eber, the, the problem and of, 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 of obstacle. See, this is the same lawyer, lawyer of Mazen Nanikani telling you. Because Maxwell, Maxwell didn't just come out to make that comment. He said that he didn't agree because Mazen Nanikani was told him that he will never get justice in, in, in Nigerian court. Even when they are caught, you know, choose to look at where I do the, uh, the, the necessary thing by what law gives, like, this man did nothing. So by this, discharge and acquit him, you know, on, on condition that Nigerian government will still interfere and say, no way, they will not let him go. And the master say, yes, not once, not twice, not, 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 not the job. Yeah, master, that's all. He now believes master and can. And that's the reason why every boy, every Serbian should believe Simon ever. Are you getting me? So any near body bed, but it will not go on by ya. On where the the people are going to go, they are almost by the other day and after that we have a problem. If I know no signal, no back wall out. 
In one of course, in Nam, Wak go, Wak Wala, Wak Wala, in one of problem that the job has not. Only have I met some boy or girl, you know, some of them I know about boy who really never. When Kavi Pohana for Nasa or Guy has given Nagi, Wak Wala, no game with my idea, you must have his party at his. So Wak Wala, on your time, if these people could look like I give Kumia Punya. Two money in the hammer, and say how you will suffer the the, 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 the the sin of your father. That's how it's been done. Do you hear Israel listening? Isn't this well and again the in the uh, American or Western world now say there's a uh, uh, um, uh, ceasefire rubbish? Who started this nonsense? Who first threw the stone at you? Live in a glass house and then you throw stone at you know, in that area, they may be listening to them. After one, one comment, now me targeting Nelson and Netanyahu will go that way. You cost them, then they will kill you. You're working so now nah, they are out for truth for getting a separate truth for that. The other group, yeah, but I found that I get out and I can now watch that. And I feel like I'm one now, come look up again. I remember telling you, I also remember saying it live on your program. That I told our leaders, I was so specific about them here the, 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 because we also we also see in we also see those things that ordinary you know mere mortal being can could not see because we also we also do well be you know our beings in the spirit so we, we can look at things and ascertain. Any nearby is because they would have preferred any nearby base, no, not silent house, the hammer when Simon, the banana, the barrier, and the woman who needs Simon. The only young Hannah come get Hannah walk with the poor GK, those years, get it was in the quality of Mamma Kachi, get the Zenazina, and would want them to give to them, yeah, my former, get it was a chocolate. Just tell me. And in your body, we could not hold it any longer. He has to lament and say it in the house of Senate House. The only have my own and the high so that these people are cooperating, they are working with them. Nagana Pugel, I think, it just seems to be a bit. That is very spot on. You remember, in your body, I actually mentioned the name of Chick and Dosiem in the Senate House that these are the people he's working with. So, I really thank this, my brother, Tukukel. And then he sent another voice. This voice, part of it is for me, and part of it is a repeat, but it was, it was more specific here. Yeah. I'll play it when it gets to my own personal one. I will end it, because it's, it's not very long. All right, let's go. program. <laughs> I can as well in that it can kind of feel that grace a bit. You can also it can kind of remind me of that. Uh, because uh, I, if you could remember very well, I've told you, I've, everybody, because now I was so lucky you were told you to that day. Just now, just there, you are going to I see it. Both the numbers were so shocked. No, they wouldn't do that number. And that's exactly the way Mazinam kind of responds. I got second number zero. Mazinam kind is a spiritual man, and he takes correction. He takes correction. When you correct him, he will respond to you, no matter how low you are. And it's the same thing our prime minister does today. I'm telling you, the same thing. If our prime minister, you give our prime minister a suggestion, and he knows it is for the interest of Biafra, or singing Dewo, Machineke, Dewo, there is nothing about them that is different. These two people are so committed to your freedom. I'm telling you, that's why when they kidnap Mazin Namikano and discover that there is another parallel, you know, figure that is even more rugged than Mazin Namikano, but the same spirit, they want to quench it also. The same thing. Mazin Namikan. Hey. Oh my God. Let's listen to Chukugel. Who that number? Can I I see only in the I read the one and it's so emotional. Okay, now where do you for some I should be myself? Yeah, I'm the face you. I am myself. 
I am a man. We should caution him. We should caution him. Anything that makes sure any of these people to uh, a kind of hide them. We should caution him. I am a messy again. Did you hear that? Mazin Lambekanu gave them permission that any day he comes on live and says anything positive about any Naya Baribe or about any of these politicians, that we should caution him. That we should caution, we should call him out and say, Mazin Lambekanu, enough. We should correct him instantly. That he will never be online again and praise these criminal politicians. That was after that time he started exposing people like Ifan Yoba when he told us that Ifan Yoba is going about using his name that he doesn't know him all. That anyway you see this man, Ifan Yoba, he even made, he said a lot of things to make you understand that he has no respect for all these politicians. Repeat this again, please. I the so emotional I should be myself. I am a man. We should caution him. We should caution him. Anything that makes sure any of these people to uh, a kind of hide them. We should caution him. And I'm a messy again. He's in the bayada and Thank you. I had digest the appreciation. The end of the zone. Of your fighting, boy, and do not talk. Money intersection. Now that the question and answer. We repeat here. CPA France. Any day you hear me trying to praise these people, I appreciate them. Please caution me that you will no longer do it again. And Emma, Emma, after that program, that some people don't really know, for those of them that are claiming that they stand solidity for him, even when their law says that no, no city or any government in government parasite, or any open who occupy his seat. When a sort of right, my name is Yaji Abu Rwane, and he will make us say, I stood for him at this and that. You know, I would have loved to, but get a mamba tamulai. The mamba tamulai, okay, that was uh, for me. He would have loved to join me, but he couldn't join me live on the program. But at least we have heard him. This was a live encounter. One on one with Mazin Namdekam. Only do himself spoke with our brother here, Mazich Kuken. Life and direct. He answered his message, and he now called Onyendu. Onyendu was now speaking to him direct. They spoke on on signal direct. Onyendu was very emotional about it and told him that look, caution me whenever you hear me mention the name of these people. Correct me instantly. Don't allow it to fly. I am going to give the microphone to my people on the platform today, and uh, still on our What? What is or what was his relationship with Mazin Namdekan? What kind of relationship did any Nayabaribe have with Mazin Namdekan? Any Nayabaribe never had a rapport, a sweet, cordial relationship with Mazin Namdekan. He only fronted himself as an instrument of the zoo that he is trying to stand shorty for Mazin Namdekan. But as an instrument of the zoo, when Mazin Namdekan identified that, he said we should caution him, he will never praise this again. That is why you see any Nayabaribe. Did not say anything about Mazin Namkanu's freedom for the past three years. He never spoke out that Mazin Namkanu should be free for the past three years. Now, at the nip of three years, any neighbor is coming out now to tell you that he met with Mazin Namkanu and that Mazin Namkanu admitted that he will surrender to any condition. Somebody he never had a relationship with. Somebody for the past three years he has never even spoken about that he should be free. Somebody who after he won Nigerian criminal justice system in their own court and he was delivered and discharged and acquitted. Any neighbor never said anything. The same man who believed that we are in a country of rule of law. When rule of law are now played on somebody you are not claiming that you met with, a rule of law is now playing and you are saying that he will admit to conditions. Conditions of what? If the conditions does not have to do with the same rule of law that you claim that the country is playing, who are you deceiving to tell us that he will not admit to surrender? Eh? So now, what is the relationship? He, thank you, my daughter. Thank you for locking that door. What is the relationship he has with any Naya Baribe? So I am going to give the microphone to my people in the platform today so that we will nip this on the board. Nobody should ever have any positive thought or support for these criminals that are not fronting themselves and speaking on social media. They want Mazin Namkan to be released. All of you, Triple M, 
Open your mic and uh, grab the mic. Triple N. Unmute yourself. Okay, maybe I'm the one that muted. Let me see if you are still there. Yeah, I'm here. All right. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? I can hear you now. Watch it. Yeah, good morning, my brother. Good morning, Pastor Van Van Van. Good morning, my fellow friends. I appreciate us this morning. Van Van Van, I wish you, I wish you quick recovery. Yeah? So, uh, you know, our people, it's high time we know that the whole, I keep saying it right from the onset. The whole, the, all the, all the criminal positions in, uh, in Biafra land, none of them are there for the representative of the people. They are not there for us. You know, it baffles me sometimes when people will come and say, um, in the in this your matter now, you have to take it to your to your so-called uh, so-called uh, representative that when you when you talk to them, they will take it to federal. Brother, there is nothing, they are not there to represent to you, even your matter. Your matter doesn't cross Niger, your matter doesn't cross River Niger. Once they go, even when they drag your matter to to uh, to do, to so called Abuja, you see them kneeling them down for bringing your matter to them. I don't know if you're getting my point. I'm, I hope, hope I'm still coming out. You are now, coming out. I mute the mic because of Nam the Nam is crying. Okay. Just go ahead. Now, now look at uh, look at uh, the so called Abuja. You know, uh, in 2017, when our our leader was freed. He were, he were like Galavantin. He was the one that, you know, that shot uh, our leader. It was our leader that, that came out on radio, make it emphatically clear that he, him as a senator, he doesn't have right to shot anybody. But he was Galavantin. Now, look, look, you just look, 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 look at what, what he was saying. When, if you are, if you are, if you are someone that reason well, and a psychologist, look at his mouth on what he was saying. Our leader is who we know. We know our leader for a very long time. We know what he can say and what he cannot be able to say. Our leader said is is even he can is 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 even preferable for him to die than to be in Nigeria. But look at the kind of thing they are they are gushing out on their mouth that our leader said he will accept any condition. Hmm. My brother, well, uh, all, all I need, I want to tell them is that they don't know what is coming. They don't know, they don't know what is coming. Even the the so called the so called Igbo Igbo position. The 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 the, the not that doesn't even tell them exactly what they are passing through. They're just pushing them. You know, they are, they are not coming direct. They are pushing our people as as stupid as stupid as they are, and they are working. They are bringing enmity to their people. They are the people fighting us. It's not even the Nigerian government. It is they are using our own to fight us. Only time, only time will tell. Only time will tell. All we know is that the, this is the final battle. You know, when you are fighting, they say this is the last, the uh, uh, the extra time, the the, the die minute. That is the time minute we are into now, and they, 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 they can never stop us. The more they do, the more the time keep approaching. I, I appeal to our people. You know that I, okay, I, the, the news that they gushed out last time about the so-called people that they killed in Lagos, they say kidnappers, police, key series of kidnappers. I would like ask him, police, Nigeria police, nine kidnappers. No, no policeman was injured. No, no yes. interchange of bullet. They just present themselves to be killed, just like that. Yes. And they brought yes. them up. You see With them no no one shot, or, 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 or shot on their leg. You see, and, they, and, they, and they have their own AK-47 with them, so yes. police was able to overpower yes. nine of them, all of them. I see, <laughs> my goodness, my goodness. <laughs> they were just Zoo. goats that just presented Zoo. themselves. Zoo. 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 They, Zoo, they can never, they, can, they don't even know how to lie. That is the main problem. They don't know how to lie. Yeah, more than all, I'm not going to lie. Please, let me use the mic and allow that Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I'll just relieve you from the stage. Thank you so much. All right, go ahead and uh, Chino. So please grab the mic. Well, well, good morning from here. I greet oh, all the people in the in the in the house and uh, my regards to Oba Tobie. I go to want a needle near here on Alabia Palan. Me chuko ka poteti mangajim or in all his movements. The thing is very simple. Let me give you an example of Abaribe. With your government. When policeman 
arrest somebody. But another policeman can never become a trustee for the suspect. You must go outside and bring somebody who is not a police, who is not a vigilante. You must bring an outside outside person to come and to see that person to so that he can be easy to be arrested. So Abari Behu is in the who is a Nigeria government who kidnapped Mas and Nande and who is plagiarizing to solve their foundation. In the constitution, he has no right to sort him. Abaribe is playing a role of Anjoba. You know how Anjoba destroyed destroyed Wazrike? You know how he, he destroyed Wazrike? That is the role of Enemia Abaribe. That is the relationship between Mazen Nande Khan and the Abaribe. Abaribe think that they could use him the way they use Anjoba to destroy Wazrike. And now, in the first place of kidnapping, arresting Mazan and Carlo in Lagos, they could not succeed. He come back again with that same method. And he also want to make himself to become the topic that Biafra will see him as a good person. Like the voice notes you played, I listened to that particular program that on Friday morning, when Aurida said, even he may cause on a <laughs> I am trying to get them that, that particular audio broadcast of Mazen and the Kano. How will he, he blast any near Baribe? And that is where he told him, I don't care whether you owe my life, I will tell you the truth. Take my life away from me, I'm okay. He blasts him. And if you look at any near Baribe, any near Baribe is a snake. Watch him very well. Watch him slowly. He's, danger, he's silent and dangerous. He is not his mission. His mission is to make sure that he stop Mazen Nande Khan from Biafra. That is why he's coming as if he is a relationship with Mazen Nande Khan. This is the relationship between Satan and Christ. This is the relationship between Satan, the, the snake, and the Eve in the Garden of Eden. That is who Enyinia Baribe is. Enyinia Baribe is the snake who did Eve. Plagiarized Eve to accept the truth and destroyed him. So, but we are happy that our leader understands all these politicians because their intention about Biafra it can never be genuine. Their intention is to destroy. So, any near Baribe is is Nigeria government. Nigeria government is any near Baribe. Any near Baribe is Anjoba of our time of Mazin Nande Khan and Simon Eva. You are calling to. It's not Simon. What is the work of Simon? And what is the work of 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 of, uh, of uh, uh, Nandekan? Okay, let's put it in this way. What is the work of Peter and work of Jesus Christ? Is it not all about preaching the gospel? What is Simon mm -hmm. is preaching? Freedom. What is Simon by is preaching? Freedom. You are against you now. You have become to like one and hate one. That is why the the Nigerian government still remain divide and rule. Any near Baribe has come to divide IPOG by succeeding of getting those those who obeyed him, like those commander of uh, of of Wazrike obeyed and Yoba to make sure they, they use him to stop Wazrike. But the difference are very clear. This is a man who believes in God. So we must understand that they have come with their evil agenda to destroy the Afro revolution, but they cannot. Hey, boy, we move. Hey, boy. Thank you so much. Thank you, my brother. Your point is very valid and very on point. I will relieve you for one second. Okay, okay, Chuku. No, Oga Chuku Okafo. Please grab the mic. Okay. Okay, one of my name. Okay. Because it's quite good. No, I say, um, uh, I've been no catch. She can say for anyone. But I didn't tell you, from day one, for me, I'm not pushing this to anybody. My belief and my... Uh, uh